my cold. It's getting worse. Hmm, I'm not feeling well. My teacher sent me to the clinic. Good morning, doctor. My name is Abigail. My teacher sent me here because I am not feeling well. Hello, Abigail. I'm Dr. Wealthy, and I will give you a checkup. Okay, doctor. First, I will check your temperature. Next, I'm going to use the stick to check your mouth. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Now I will be checking your chest. Inhale and exhale. Doctor, to be honest, I'm worried because of this pandemic, also known as COVID-19. Don't worry, Abigail. After checking you, the symptoms I've noticed are not related to the coronavirus. Thank you, doctor, for the information. It makes me feel comfortable. Since you brought up this pandemic called coronavirus, I will tell you a few things about it. Thank you, doctor. I would like to know about it so I can protect myself from it. <coughs> doctor, I'm coughing. What should I do? Drink plenty of water and eat food that are rich in vitamin C. Meanwhile, wear this mask, and then we'll discuss about coronavirus. Okay, doctor. To start with, let me explain to you what is a novel coronavirus. A novel coronavirus is a new coronavirus that has not been previously identified. The virus causing coronavirus disease 2019, COVID-19, is not the same as the coronavirus that commonly circulate among humans and cause mild illness, like the common cold. Doctor, why is the disease being called coronavirus disease 2019 or COVID-19? On February 11, 2020, the World Health Organization announced an official name for the disease that is causing the 2019 novel coronavirus outbreak, first identified in Wuhan, China. The new name of this disease is coronavirus disease, 2019, abbreviated as COVID-19. In COVID-19, CO stands for corona, VI for virus, and D for disease. Formerly, this disease was referred to as 2019 novel coronavirus or 2019 and COV. Now we will be discussing about signs and symptoms. Patients with COVID-19 have experienced mild to severe respiratory illness like fever, cough, and shortness of breath. If these three symptoms occur, immediately seek medical doctors. Okay, doctor. But doctor, how is the virus transmitted? The virus is transmitted through direct contact with infected patients by means of droplets during the patient's coughing or sneezing, by way of contacts with patient's toes then directly touching the nose, mouth, or eyes. And now, we will be discussing on how to prevent coronavirus. Prevention from getting the coronavirus. Wash your hands with soap and water or use alcohol based on hand rub. Cover your nose and mouth with a tissue when coughing or sneezing or flexed elbow. Avoid shaking hands and hugging. Stay at home and avoid contact to person with a cold and flu-like symptoms. Wear a protective mask when going to crowded places. 
Is there a treatment for the new coronavirus? Supportive medical care is provided to help relieve the acuteness of the symptoms and control complication. Is there a vaccine for the new coronavirus? So far, there's no available vaccine yet, as approved by World Health Organization, but different medical experts are trying their best to find one. Okay, Abigail, get well soon. I hope you learned something today. And please share this information to your classmates and your family members. Thank you for your concern, doctor. And I will definitely share your information to my classmates and my family members. Thank you for watching. If you liked the video, please like, share, and subscribe.